Okay, so we are playing Mom Hid My Game. Remember, average person. What do you mean? I don't get it. Real quick here. So, I'm this little bitch. This is way into video games, mom. Mom is all mad because you all, you all you do is play video games. And now, I'm looking for my game. I don't know where it is. Also, it's a Japanese game if the language isn't obvious enough. We are not average people, probably according to Snapple. Oh, I mean, yeah, on average. What's average and what isn't though? That's the thing, I'm not average either, so I wouldn't know like where to put my head. Okay, move to the room, move to the room, open options, touch, back, jump to menu, jump to inventory. Cursor control. That or that. Tutorial. Touch any point of it. Okay, well, we'll figure it out. So, yeah. We'll... So, there's. How much stages? Oh, there's a lot of stages, actually. No, okay, 50 stages. I think we can, we can definitely get this done today, I would think. I would hope. Basically, it's, it's like a point and click for um, their creative and not so creative ways to, um, uh, what's the word? Find your game. So just literally interact with everything and see what you can find. Oh, there it is. Inside here. Okay, so. How's the audio? Is it too loud? We're probably bound to end up below the average for the- Oh, I see. How's that? Okay, cool. Uh, I don't know what- I don't know, like, what you're referring to, though. Is this about making noise whatsoever with your mouth? If it's lips, is it kissing? Let's see, so in other levels, you gotta find, you gotta watch out for mom because if you if she, if you find mom, game over. <laughs> Pretty much, it is kissing. Oh. That's weird to say, probably if Dante, we're not average people. That's true, though. Oh, there's a game. See, so, yeah, game's up there, but I cannot reach, clearly. So we get the step ladder. Yeah, right, feels bad, man. And use it. And then we get it. Perfect. Two weeks kissing. That seems kind of low. I mean, if you add, I mean, I, if that's just straight, straight up smooching and not like, you know, adding um, like makeout sessions and whatnot. I don't know, to be honest. But I feel like two weeks would be too low if you take into account like makeout sessions. I feel at least. We're going to super fast. This is gonna be like a super fast ass uh, game. This bot's gonna be like literally 30 minutes. Okay, you see, alligator has the game. But he ate my he ate my hands. I probably should have just played Tetris, huh? This game was on my catalog, so I'm just trying to clear it right right now since you know it kind of works out. So 
mom is peeking or peeking, seeing what I'm up to. I'm hiding in the crocodile. Yeah, I mean, I feel like that's not that's not above what this game would this game will be doing. I feel like, but you know, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Look at that. that ain't sus. All right, mom. Well, I mean, can I just play this one instead? I'm obviously referencing Zelda. I knew it. I want the gold one, though. Yeah, saving game's like, no. Can't get the, the shiny premium edition. It's not your real game. You drop your shield into like the one of the fairy fountains and then the fairy comes up and gives you a nicer shield. But in this case we're downgrading, obviously. Alright, day six. VR headset? Oh, I know. Here, mom, have some VR. There's 50 of this, 50 of these levels, so I think we'll be fine. Depending on how I feel afterward, I won't, I don't know. We have water. Mom's just chilling behind the trees. Wait. That is a washroom, okay. I think we know what to do. Here, Grandpa, drink lots of water. Drink all the water you can, your old ass bladder can handle. <laughs> Why doesn't kid just use the VR headset? Does he want to play? <laughs> That's me, dog. Yeah, well. Interesting that it was underneath the Grandpa the entire time. Touches whenever you get game over, the controller vibrates. Very immersive. Okay, we got cheese. Oh, I see. Put cheese. Uh, this feels like if a mobile, mobile game, <laughs> a mobile game ad was Japanese. The wallet. Oh shit. Okay, don't take the wallet. Okay, so there's, there's some trap items too, apparently. Okay, I put the cheese in front of the mouse hole, obviously. So you can all go back. There it is. Game! I mean, again, I did find- I did discover this game on mobile, and they talked about that they had it on Switch, and I'm like, what? So I picked it up. And so... I literally didn't do anything. Hold on, wait, let's retry that. I want to see how- I don't understand the concept here. Wait. And his mom, obviously, because of the. Yeah. I had to confirm my suspicions. I like it matters. Okay, well, we beat it anyway. Oh, we are waiting. Oh, I shook my controller. I shook my Joy Cons. Okay, so there's a little bit of a... 
Okay, that's kind of cool, actually. Alright, bicycles. Somehow he developed... a crosswalk. Bicycle tires. Done. Oh god. It's fucking a quiet place. You ever seen that movie? <laughs> okay. Okay, they thought this through clearly. Yeah, it's fat thumbtack. It'll like, like cover like the base of my my heel, like my entire heel. Pick that up. And then go. Get the game. Be good. I can see the thumb that that was based off of. Big thumbtack for big boys. Okay, um. Safe. Oh shit, it's blinking. Okay. An actual crosswalk with traffic, um, traffic lights. Cool. Super fast. Doing the shoulders can let you. Switch between scenes quicker. Day 12 out of 50. Hey, Grandpa. Beat Grandpa with the hammer. Oh, that's too dark, dude. Wait, is that a thing? Hold on. I just want to see if this is a thing. I'm not actually doing this on purpose. Oh, God. <laughs> Bitch, I slap you with this hammer. He like took it from me, dude. Alright. Go to horny jail. Okay, yeah, so obviously we use it on this. What is that? A coin? Give the money to grandpa. Him. All right, and then beat him with a hammer after. <laughs> no, that's too dark. Just kidding, Grandpa. We love you. Okay. So my mom hit my game. Oh shit, she got me. She caught me cooking fish. Mom, I made it for you. What are you what are you doing? Give me my game. I cook food for you. Okay, I bet it's probably inside this shell. God damn it, mom. Took the shell, the shell opens up, mom's inside too. Probably the game though. Sound. Like a super anime sound. Okay, we now have an elephant. Oh, wait, don't tell me. Do not tell me. Is 
Is he gonna shit out the game? He's gonna shit out the game, isn't he? <laughs> yeah. There's your elephant in the room right here. Fucking eat the orange, dude. Put on your nose. Oh, that's what the tissue's for. Okay. We clean the game with the tissue. And no questions asked. It is clean and indeed usable. Stop at 10 seconds. Like Mom's just chilling again. game this is. I love it, actually. Okay. Ten seconds, right? I'll use my timer, actually. Hit this at the 24-minute mark. Oh, it's right there. Look, it doesn't... It, oh. In before it hides. Yeah, see? Look, they have my timer. Hell yeah. <laughs> Call me a cheater. It just worked out somehow. Taking shitty console to a new level. Let's like put out the bomb. Mama. Oh fuck! Mom was inside the fire extinguisher the whole time. Okay, I mean you just gotta wait for it to like let it explode. Trapped forever in the fire extinguisher, apparently. I'm down for that. Okay. <laughs> okay, just because we I want to, we're gonna explore our options here. Okay, it's not in the watermelon this time. Hydrogen peroxide. Is that what goes into a uh, fire extinguisher? I don't think it does, is it? <laughs> Obviously it's in here. But... Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see. Just in case. I think it's like I debated. I'm like debating myself now. Yeah, fair enough. Alright. Um... Mama! Oh shit, we're actually playing soccer, okay. I'm gonna use my feet. Or actually, what's this fly here on the wall? Science with it. 
No, I see what you're doing. Okay, similar, similar, um, concept. People are on their phones and shit. So, mom's hiding behind the curtain. Oh, no way. Is this, like... It's in there. East. Inventory full. Almost probably in here, I bet. I knew it. It's probably inside this pile of rocks. Here's what we'll do. We'll put two rocks. Grab the last two. Hey, we did it. That was kind of clever. So, well, yeah, they really have everything. There's an elephant, a rock crocodile. Apparently, fucking tuxedo mask here. It's probably in his hat. <laughs> you like you take off the hat and mom's inside. And then we'll suffer somewhere in Africa. True. So when you get like debated hard, I'm still waiting for it. It's another animal poops level. Shit, the fireball motion? <laughs> oh, Grandpa. Mom's in there, obviously, so we'll leave her alone. Alright, we're halfway through. Closet. Mama! Okay, so once I turn off the light, that's it. Cupboard was glowing from the game. Oh, is that, is that 
sister? Mama! Oh. Hair. CD in the player. Gotta say, it's pretty, it's pretty sick banger. Can't wait for it to move. Alright. What are you doing, step bro? Stop. Oh my god. <laughs> He's trying to get my Nintendo. Okay, <laughs> it's there. So basically, I gotta put shit in the vacuum so mom gets distracted. Fair enough. Oh, it's like literally. Okay. Put her on the other side of the room. Speech bubble. Oops. <laughs> that didn't work either. A fly? That's a snake. to the thing, isn't she? Oh my god, actually. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. We took her speech bubble. Are you serious? Wow. Fucking game gets all met up in your face. She doesn't want you to get the game, she'll even send you to the void. Get banished to the Shadow Realm. Oh, fuck. Switch scenes, but mom's hiding behind the fucking arrow key. You got canned cat food. It's obviously not gonna work. Cucumber with the cat meme or a trick, whatever, whatever, whatever you guys, whatever it's called. Okay, food first, and then the cucumber after. Where do you put it on behind him? Try, damn it. Next level. You kind of have a really bad joke just now. Like, what? Like, it didn't <laughs> Put the cucumber is somewhere inappropriate. <laughs> Oh, mom. 
Oh, it's tic-tac-toe, okay. I bitch, I win. <laughs> I'm surprised if I lost to this thing, though. Oh, I see, and then if you need extra rings, the ladder is here for that one. Clever. <laughs> Banana. Well, that's your chance to make that joke now. <laughs> Twice, I only got two chances at this. Big brain clever, but kind of like, 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 what do you call it? I know it's the word for it. Oh, there's the wallet again. Here. Oh my god. Another photo? Sort of, but still, still unique in its own way. That's obviously mom. Oh, spot the difference. Okay, so that, that. Okay. 
eat the pizza. I guess we'll appease him with this first. And then put the egg. I guess the egg didn't matter. Security camera. So she's watching. Okay, what we got? Oh fuck. Okay, so let's not do that. Just turn it. Turn it is good enough. That is. Oh, it's like a metal detector, okay. Oh shit, it's mom. Mama! They <laughs> do it in the walls. <laughs> Differently. I guess red means danger, but I mean, I didn't know. I, I could have known that going in, though. Oh my god, that looks so disturbing, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. So that obviously means alien light right there. I was working with the aliens now, apparently. To prevent from getting my video game. Well, just think there's a goat that's conveniently hiding in the closet. Hints. I refuse to use hints. Um. Aha. Uh -huh. There you go. We tricked her. We tricked mom. And some bowling, obviously. Oh, that 
those look so easy. Seem hit the egg because for the lulls, there are any. Did the chicken attack me? What the hell? I mean, I wasn't expecting a chicken, so I think it's worth. Open that window, like fully. There we go. Remember, when playing golf indoors, don't forget to open your windows, right? So that means I shouldn't open these, right? Okay, we'll leave it like we'll leave it like we'll leave it at that. Um, what's in here? Nothing. Nothing here. Obviously a snake. So let's get this one here. Oh, okay. Play with the kitty. Uh, apparently not. <laughs> okay. Somehow, so that's mom. That's a snake, right? Yeah. No way around that either. What do we use a string on? The jar? to do. Okay. Apparently cats like to do that, hey? Alright, so we're playing darts this time. Oh, I see. So we're running on a time limit too. What is that? Yeah. What? 
the hell, Grandpa in a, in a wrestling mask? What the fuck? Okay, there's obviously a pin somewhere that I haven't gotten. I gotta find the gold one. That's a snake, obviously. Oh, there's a snake in There's a thing in there. Hold on, hold on. I had a thought. We're good. Yeah, that's a snake. Oh, we almost done this. Short stream, I suppose. Potato, water, ice cube, oil. Okay, let's cook them. Um, we got french fries. Get the fries to mom. Wait, what are you getting mad at me for? I cook fries for you, dog. What the fuck? I like the pizza with french fries. Apparently not. Okay. Ice cube. How about some water? You can use it. Can... Okay, somehow adding more water <laughs> caused the fire. <laughs> Ice cube. Yeah. Alright, apparently not. I was gonna be, yeah, sounds good. I might end stream here too after this. Oil. because we wait for the fire to go off now we can like now we can add stuff okay no not night crown discard fair enough yep i've been there too a few times Younger me and my friends used to like spend all night playing uh what do you call it? Playing the MMORPGs literally into the into the morning. And then I open up your server they have been talking about open up opening up your server to the public? Fries now, though. Oh, well, I burned myself. We will figure this out somehow. Okay, 
I didn't mean to touch it. No, please undo. Undo. Damn it. You grab the potatoes. Jam those in here. We got fries. Uh, okay, if I switch scenes, the fire goes up. I don't know if that means anything or not. Some water, mom. Throw the water at her. Oh, wait, I think I got it. If you give her like the raw potato, she'll probably go and cook it herself. Get all the ingredients first, just in case. I guess I'm on the right track giving him giving cooking the fries here. Then what? Put the fries on the pillow? Inventory is full. Oh okay, I can grab the pillow. Hold up, hold up, hold up. What is she trying to do there? Oh, whatever, it's cool. Wait, so you're part of like that, you're part of the Honey Bun Dubs Discord team? A patron, I see, I see. Okay, if mom sees us doing our homework, she'll be like, oh, what good kid you are. Oh. Hell yeah. Alright, that's a lesson. Do your homework and uh, you can get rewarded somehow. Right. Obviously, he's gonna bat the, the gaming system. Yes. Mama. Well, that's not the way to do it, apparently. I made too much noise. This is what I can use though. Oh, he took his bat, literally. Mama! Oh, okay, I know what to do, I know what to do. So we take his bat. We jam the door with the bat. Then we boosh nailed it. We have lots of stuff for them that they featured on streams and such. I mean, I would imagine like the stuff that you drew, right? Those are pretty good drawings too. Pretty dope. And I take it you're. I've seen a few of your YouTube videos on the. Uh, Oh no, is he turning into a gamer? 
He is. He's a gamer now. Day 1000. Oh no. I'm afraid to see what we look like, dude. <laughs> game over. We touched the game. Okay, I get the point. I haven't seen Read Doorman. No, I have not. I have not seen it. Dude, he's a gamer now. <laughs> Damn. Son, it's been a thousand days. Damn. Umedeto. Yes. Congratulations, by the way. Oh, there you go. All right. Is that the end of the game? something. I want to see what it says. Crazy horizontal bar. Press A. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, apparently this is a thing. All right. It's gonna be spinning until I get a hundred percent, whatever the hell this means. I think you get different poses. Hey, Grad, how are you? Welcome, fellow bears. I'm probably wondering what the hell I'm playing. Have any of you heard of a game called Mom, I Hid My Game? Shit, hold on, hold on. Okay, we'll do this later. Um, I recently finished with Undertale way earlier than I expected, so I was looking for a one-off to play for my collection. I don't know if you heard about this game. Basically, you are a kid gamer. It's, it's, a, it's a point and click where mom, each of these stages, mom takes your game, hides it, um, and then you just gotta find it. So I can go from, since, since I have y'all here, feel free to watch real quick. It goes from simple, like, finding your game and like, actually I don't remember the level anymore. From um, <laughs> literally a bookshelf, where and it gets more ridiculous, such as um, actually I don't know. Right, here we go, perfect example. So mom clearly put your game on top of a window. Look around, find a step ladder, grab it, place it, <laughs> and then voila. There you go. Some game, some levels there are traps in which uh, mom might show up, and if it, mom sees you, then you just gotta retry. Like, for example, not very exciting, I know. Let me see if I can find another extreme example, and I know I'm pretty sure most of you guys aren't probably gonna play this, so we'll go to the last level just to spoil it for y'all. Which exactly, I don't know what she was doing in the closet. She just happened to be there. Here's an, here's an example of a weird one. 
Um, see, look, his mom just chilling behind the lamppost. You don't want to, like, you know, trigger her. But then, yeah, the game, in this level, the game is in the watermelon. So basically how I found this game is, like, maybe easily five or six years ago, I found this on mobile. And so, yeah. Played a little bit, they said, oh, there's a there's a Switch version of this game. I was like, what? And I looked, looked it up, and coincidentally it was on sale too for, like, maybe, like, Three or four bucks Canadian. So I was like, hell yeah, bought it. More levels compared to the mobile version as well, too, so. And yeah, obviously in the watermelon. Oh, let me see, there's one here that I think you would enjoy. What game are you playing, by the way? I'm assuming you're playing more, um, the more, uh, Minish Cap, I think, right? Am I correct to assume that? Not exactly the same, same, uh, exact game, but similar Like, the references I'm pretty sure you'll, you'll get. I can just find it. Here we go. Oh, you just finished it. Congrats, dude. How are the dungeons and stuff? Okay, here we go. So, here's a, here's a fun little Zelda one. I mean, I'm it's obvious that they're referencing Zelda here. So, gold... Gold game console. Obviously, you don't want that. Throw it in the pond. What comes out? A fairy. And then just take the one that you want. Oh, see, that is pretty great. Today was just the final hour, well, final area. And then, you, and now you're done. So what's next? So there's the Zelda reference one. Here's something. And then this level I enjoyed. Cause it got- it literally got me. Ooh, Eternal Darkness? Dude, I'd watch that. Any plans for October? Is any scary games? Yeah, planned. So, somehow we have a cycling road at home. The trick to this one is... Find, like, some kind of wedge thingy. Get the thumbtack off the wall, and just a little asshole kid as you are, pop all the tires of all the uh, of all the cyclists. I thought this was good enough, so I proceeded, and I literally got a quiet place. If you understand that. All right, catch up. Have a good night. But yeah, several examples of ones that just really. They're like, some of them are really simple, some of them are really out there. Some of them are kind of clever. A lot of times they got, like, debated hard. Like this one, for example, here. Pretty much done with all the levels, and that unlocked uh, a mini game. Which, you know, being the completionist streamer that I am, I'm, there's a, a little criteria for it. Hold on, hold on, I don't spoil it. So, the bomb. Here's what you're thinking normally. Oh my god, bomb, right? I gotta put it out. Fire extinguisher, check. Put it out? What the fire extinguisher? Turns out, mom's in the fire extinguisher. Like, what the fuck, dude? An example of Jibit. Much. Yeah, Prince, this is literally a wacky game, wacky ass game overall. So, and, and obviously, the idea at this point is just to let the. Let the wick go off. Yeah, since you're here, I'll just showcase a few of these levels. Because... Technically, I've done them all already. What's next is pretty, like... Pretty, like, plain AF, but I gotta do it to complete everything in this game. Uh, what else is good? I mean, this one's pretty much a reference to any fighting game whatsoever. Old grandpa, and, oh, open your open your curtains to find out you have a a command for a fireball slash hadoken. There you go. Yeah, 
Yeah, so it's, it's like it's like all, it's like way out there. This game. Nice little short. I guess it took me about an hour to do, but again, there's just a tiny bit more I want to do, so I'm gonna do that. What else is good? I'll showcase a few more, and then we'll look at the last level again. Or how about this? Pick a number between 1 and 50. And let's see, because uh, honestly, as much as I... Actually, wait, wait, wait. Before you do that, actually, is a... Saw it. Another clever one. 37? Oh, with the face? Yeah, okay, sure. We'll do that now, then. I'll let y'all pick, since I'm pretty much done with all these levels. So... Got a face here. Um, clicked it once, and the kid reached into it. So obviously, for some reason, mom jammed our game in there. So the idea is to appease the uh, appease the wall god or whatever. You got pizza. Pizza. Well, pizza on its own isn't good because we just literally ripped it out of the freezer. So obviously, you got to heat it up. I thought that was good enough. I, th I thought that wasn't good enough, so I literally took the egg and heated it up too, and look what happens when you do that. So my mom finds out, <laughs> busts through the wall, <laughs> and destroys your microwave. It's like, yeah, it's, it's a really weird way out there thing. Totally something you wouldn't normally expect. Alright, so we'll eat the pizza. when you're expecting anything unexpected. I mean, that's a good mindset to take if you actually choose to play this game going in blind. Feed the pizza. He did obviously to the guy. He's like, oh, yeah, thank you. Feel free to reach in and grab the console. And there we go. There's one that, that I wanted to show as well. A really good one. One that's one that I thought was really good, actually. I can find it. Okay, we'll do the elephant one in a sec. Is it one of these? A few more, and then we'll do the. Then I'm gonna go back to what I was doing, which is mini game that I unlocked after finishing. Oh no, wait. We'll level we'll showcase level 50, and then we'll go back to the. Mini game. God, where is it? Here we go. Got some dudes just chilling, hanging out on their phones, obviously. Look what's in your drawer. A, G a GPS marker. Drop that, get the dudes on, on their phones there. And there you go. Game console. That one I thought was pretty, like, pretty clever. Like, cheeky in a fun way. Some of them are just, like, cheeky for the sake of cheekiness. So level 50, once you finish all the stages... Actually, no, hold on, hold on. Actually, yeah. So what happened is, in stage 49... Actually, we'll do that instead. No, no, we're already here. But basically, at stage 49, there's a point where you basically jam yourself in your room. In day 50, you're playing your game constantly, and clearly he grew up to be gamer. And then if you continue playing games, obviously, at this point, it's game over. So, like, the idea is that you, um, unjam your door and go out into the world a thousand days later and reunite with your family again. Yeah, it, you know, all in all, very weird. Very weird, yet very enjoyable. And again, I played it just because I was looking for a quick run, quick one-off to just get out of the way. Because again, I finished Undertale a lot sooner than I expected today. I was expecting to go like at least maybe... Th 
three or four hours more. But yeah. I literally finished it up in like an hour and a half, hour and a half around there. It was my first playthrough, yeah. Um, I started last week. I did uh, a full pacifist playthrough and then another playthrough that wasn't so pacifist and then back to another pacifist playthrough because if you do the not pacifist playthrough the ending shifts a little i was kind of curious to see what it was and during then that was like the last playthrough i did i tried to like collect everything bought all the secret bosses and whatnot as well but yeah so for this here, after I finish the game, I unlock the minigame called Crazy Horizontal Bar, and depending on how well you do, you apparently get a bunch of different like poses, you know, like the, how how your character sticks the landing. And apparently there's a lot, because look at this. That means something. That means I have to find more of these. So literally it's just straight up me doing this for like the next, I don't know, how long. 20 minutes. Depending on how many poses are there and how fast I can get these done, I think the longer you're here, the less points you get. I really don't know. Oops. No, because I try to play everything 200% it. I gotta do it all. You never played it, huh? I mean, I would recommend it. It's a really good game. Like, honestly, I, you know, I don't want to sound like a, one of them Undertale fans, but I found no faults with it personally, and I really enjoyed the story through and through. There's another, another, like, hardcore fans out there, too. Get it. I was spinning earlier. I was hearing how to spin. How did I spin last time? I think so too, personally. It's been like, the game came out back in like, what, three or four years ago? I remember watching a few videos, like, especially like the Sans fight. While, while the game was still hot. But, you know. This. Like, I think the idea is to just try and spin. Yeah, see, so it's a new pose. Um, let's see. How does it work? Okay, so literally 50 poses? Two poses, 4%. I mean, if I'm doing math correctly. I mean, even if people were to influence how you play, for me personally, I'd just be like, you know, no, no backseating, please. But, you know, there are people who can't help it, obviously. Or try to spell it. Yeah, to be fair, honestly, uh, yesterday, I had some people that came in, were talking about, like, a lot of lore stuff. But by that point, I was already on my third playthrough, so I knew pretty much how a lot of the things went. But they did say things that if I hadn't played through the game already, it would it would have spoiled it for me for sure. So, but again, I guess you know it really depends on how you handle it or how you choose to handle it, really. You know, it, it's one of those games. Like, where people are just super passionate and big fans about it. And, you know, for a perfectly good reason, because the game is just that good to draw a, a crowd slash fan base of that many. Yeah. I, mean, I guess that's why people played it, like, right away as soon as it, was, as soon as it came out, you know? To avoid being spoiled. And 
here we are like three or four years later playing the game. Why is this taking so long? Come on. at this angle for the longest time I think okay I get it now minus 20 I don't think it matters I think you just get them randomly I think it feels like so we're just gonna play till we get all the poses <laughs> I spin, keep going until you hit like a. Um, well, that's an interesting way to land. <laughs> I think you just keep going until you hit a certain speed, and then. Okay. We're gonna get all the poses. That's the plan here. for October. Last October for me it was exclusively horror stuff. What I'm looking forward to, if anything, is have you ever played a uh, Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion Regret? It's not like it's not really scary. Like, I mean, I guess it can. I mean, it depends on how you look at it, really. Because like the jump scares are very like very like cheerful. It can get very, it can range it can vary from very cheerful to like downright creepy, depending on how you look at it. But if you are looking for some other scary games, I would recommend that. I would totally love to watch you play that actually. <laughs> but if you're not sure what the game is, you know. Look it up and see if it's, if it's up your alley or not. adds up so far. Uh, Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion, have you heard of it? If you're looking for a, a scary game to play, that's one. Okay, it sounds like you have heard of it. I would love to see you play that if you are actually thinking about it. I, that was one of the games I played and completed all the way through last year. I'm scared. I don't think I've heard of that one. Oh, okay. I have seen this one. There's an idea. Oh no, kids dominoes. <laughs> Everyone says not scary at all, but you're. <laughs> Damn, dude. It's alright, you know, everyone has their own different ways of getting scared and stuff. I thought, you know, for the longest time that whenever I, when I started watching, like, a lot of scary, like, game plays on YouTube. I mean, that's how I found Spooky Jumps Convention. It didn't look like the type of game that I'd be scared of, but... Like, the jump scares really do get you. Like, I know this for a fact, but some of the developers, sometimes they just hang around people streaming. 
I did meet a couple of them on my stream a few times. And they were talking about how they're planning on releasing some sort of update this year for Halloween. So if they do that, I'm immediately jumping back in. Mind games? No, absolutely. I agree. <clears throat> I do say developer, but I think the guy, the one of the guys I talked, I mean, talked to was like a, some kind of community manager. So I mean, maybe not a direct developer, but they have, they are involved in the game to some degree, and they have knowledge, and that's the knowledge he dropped. So yeah, but, like the DLC stuff, oh, DLC, like the content that they added so far is pretty good too. Played through all of it, really enjoyed it all. Yeah, I agree. Even more so after playing that game. What other games have I played? October. Have you heard of uh, Layers of Fear? I've not. Um, yeah, it's, it's also more like a mind, like mental kind of thing. Made from the character's perspective, really. I think, I think that one's a pretty good game also if you're looking for something. There's a second one apparently now. So maybe I'll look into that. Let's see here, I don't know. I've also played uh, Until Dawn on the PS4. Very, very cliche. But still enjoyable nonetheless. got cheesy at some points, but then that's like to be expected, I suppose. Score 9.58 seconds. Oh, okay, they get all kind of weird with it. bars for the next like half hour or so. Do those take place in the same type of uh in the same kind of uh universe? Or, like, I heard of Madame Down, but like I don't think they take I mean I guess it's similar in a sense where you have like uh more than one main character. I never seen it fully, so I don't know. Any that's short and scary. One game that I don't recommend, unless you absolutely love crappy motion controls, is the Grudge game on Wii. Series of games. Yeah, I did hear that, like, the makers of uh, Madan are making like another game. Are they not? I heard someone mention it before, and I looked it up, and I saw that it was like, uh, yeah, I heard, I heard that. Crap. Gonna be out, out in hell and do interesting. I don't know if you like scary games also that I need to take care of. But Play through RE7. The one thing that's literally been sitting there amongst my PS4 collection. I want to pull up my back on my my log right now and see what else the other games I played back in October. Spooky Jumpscare Mansion. Oh yeah, Starship Damry when I was testing out my 3DS wireless capture. Until Dawn Lays of Fear. And then <laughs> The Grudge. Yeah. Yeah, 
because I had that game for the longest time back when I was a kid. As a kid when I played it, I did get I did get like scared here and there. Because I was a fan of like those movies. But yeah. Playing it again, fully. Controls are ass. <laughs> Yeah, you know, it wouldn't hurt to try if you're up for it. I'll be happy to help you as well. But again, your mileage may vary, depending on how your network connection works, as well as the game you're playing. The game that I was playing on stream with it was very, like, not action intensive, obviously, so it worked well for it. And then I tested with other games like uh, Mario 3 Land, which I would really love to stream, but yeah, <laughs> did not work well. Uh, I, I, mean, I did manage to play Pokemon Yellow on it no problem through the 3DS uh, Virtual Console, but I am setting money aside for an actual if I can find a 3DS on eBay with a capture card on it, I'm not willing to pay the money. I would love to play 3DS games. I like a whole collection just sitting here as well. And you know, they'd be good games to revisit after like how many years? with everything especially more so with the <laughs> with the climate of the world right now <laughs> oh, we're halfway through this are we 37 percent goddamn being said, I don't have a problem because I did add my 3DS games to my backlog, like my public backlog, and I believe somebody voted for a 3DS game already. Where is it? Let's see here. I mean, it's down the list at third place with 50 votes, but it's Pokemon Ultra Sun, and I know that game doesn't perform very well on OG DS, uh, um, OG DS hardware. I mean, I could easily just buy like a new 2DS for cheap. Well, not cheap, but for cheaper. And then just mod that for wireless capture and see how that works. Maybe the extra power on the new on the new series could help the wireless capture along. I have no idea. Yeah, Super Mario Party soon. I'm gonna. I already told people who were here earlier, but I'll also put it in the Discord to vote. Since I'm done with Undertale now. Oh, that's a sick landing. Look at that. I wish I could do that. I wonder what 100 points looks like. Now I'm kind of curious. But I'm pretty sure that probably won't be until like the very last, uh, the very last one I have to unlock. All right now, 50%. I only hope that you know this feels like a very elaborate gacha machine, and I hope I don't pull like like duplicates, you know. <laughs> If this turns out to be a gacha, fuck. We're gonna be here for even longer. I mean, I haven't encountered any dupes yet, no. No, I have not, thankfully. Then again, I'm at like 
I'm not even halfway with my collection yet, so let's see what we get. Yeah, that's true. I just gotta watch out for the watch out for the absence of the new year. Oops, I hit. Can't get the cursor out. Put closer to the middle here. So it's like it's a gadget that has, makes you work for it too. Then again. Gadgets make you work for it in some way or another. Ooh, sumo. 275 kilograms. Alright, keep going. Been good so far. Now I feel like this could last even as long as an hour now. God damn it. Being optimistic with like a half hour. I guess this is the perfect game to pad my stream time, I suppose. It's already midnight. So it's fine. once I finish this, I think I'll be done. It definitely feels like I'll be spending more time doing this than I actually spent on like the main game itself. No, that's fine. It's cool. That's like a thousand points already. I think it's more impressive than the finger, to be honest. I'm gonna change my title now that the main game is done. That's a new one. Also impressive. Damn it. Okay, this looks like it is in a certain order. Okay. Well, I was expecting it to be a bit longer, but I think I think we'll be we're at an okay pace. Good enough at least. At least this video won't be too short when I upload the vlog later tonight. Until part five is gonna be like an hour and a half only. Right, 
right. Again. Forty percent, so like twenty more. Less than twenty more. And so far, no dupes. I'm surprised. Maybe, maybe it isn't gonna be all unique. I'm just gonna move. Trying to get through these faster. Oh, there it is. I spoke too soon. Damn it. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, it starts. Like, I didn't even have to look, at, look for the missing, uh, the, the lack of new. I already knew to compose. I'm surprised too. I mean, what I'm thinking, what could be the case is that like, it's like fixed. It's like you're bound to get duplicates anyway. And they're just simulating, uh, simulating a gacha, maybe? I could be wrong though. I feel like that's a lot more work to put in. Having like a thick set of like stuff as opposed to just pulling from a random number generator or whatever. Pragmatically, at least. Plus lines of code, that's for sure. Oh. Okay, where are we now? Just just curious. 68. About 15 or 16 based on math. Boosh. Oh. Cover oh! something. Less to cough. <laughs> Thank you for the fa the, the bits. We really appreciate it. Sorry. My default message in my head is thank you for the follow, but thanks for the bits. How are you also? Hope you're enjoying me watch this. Hope you're enjoying me trying to get... Trying to complete my collection of poses. Also, thank you for the follow. Very appreciated. Ooh. Okay. Make some new ones still. Keep forgetting to put the cursor out of the button. and it's complete, completedness. Oh, cool. The other side of that other pose. So waiting for the 100. I don't know what the 100 point landing is going to look like. That's what I'm going to, and this is another 98, so I guess they're, I thought like, I mean again, it's not going to be like 1 to 100, because it got negative 30 there, negative 20, okay, that one was 2.5, I mean, I think that's pretty impressive for a 2.5 landing. There's 0, 22. Here we go, it's like 98 years because he was old because he's old. And then the sumo guy was like measured in weight. I don't get this one personally. 9.58 seconds. 
I built some sort of reference that I don't know. And there's the shameless company plug. There's a 98 there, and I saw another 98. Did I pass? Or did I pass? There's 99. There you go. There's the 275 kilos. Okay, I guess that is only 98. Weird. I thought I saw another one. Maybe I saw 98 years. That's probably what I saw. Anyway, let's keep going. Gotta catch them all. Damn it. I'll be honest, I didn't think I'd be streaming something like this. <laughs> for it. I did make a note to myself that any game I stream I try to 100% and so here we are. Sweet flying Nimbus pose. Dancing emojis. Bad, actually, it's about five or six more. Getting there. Yeah, that's true. Like real, real gacha games, specifically mobile, mobile pay-to pay-to-play gachas, for sure, are way worse. Mario Kart Tour. God. I really wanted to like that game. I mean, I think, like, the game itself is fine, I guess, but, like, the fact that you gotta rely on, like, specific carts and characters to get, you know, for extra points, and you can't get those without, um, you know, paying for them, for the most part. You know, that's how a lot, most mobile, um, Mobile free to play is run because you gotta make their money somewhere. Yeah, I'll just take to Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Thank you. Speaking of which, I should actually play that on stream at some point. Honestly, you're better. You're like, I wouldn't say you're better off not playing, but like, it honestly really makes no difference for me personally. Whether you played it or not, tried it or not, you're not really missing out on much. At the end, it's Mario Kart. Sure, there are some new stages, but I rather enjoy like full on like 
I'd rather put those in rather put those and enjoy those in like a full fully fleshed out game. Some of the reskins are pretty cool. But again, that's, that requires money and time that I would rather spend on, you know, playing this game, for example. Like, for me, this is more, this is a more meaningful grind than playing Mario Kart Tour. TBH. That's what I'm hoping too. But some of them aren't bad. And it was also pretty hyped to see, like, like other stage, like classic stages in that game. But yeah, for sure, if they can slap those in the next Mario Kart, whatever that will be. Do you think they'll do a Mario Kart 9 for the Switch? Because technically 8 is not a new title, right? It's just a... it's literally the same thing. But the DLC package into one thing. I would very, very much like it too. Cause you know, they would say they normally you would think you know, a new Mario Kart for every console. Not strictly just a Mario Kart game. Yeah, that's true as well. Clearly their priorities are elsewhere. That's the thing though, because like, they know their titles will sell, so they're just gonna get up. Like, they know they can get away with it, <laughs> right? You know, and uh, release one game, make gajillions, and then just be satisfied with that until that next thing. Like, their first parties are just their bread and butter. They know. <laughs> Like, like, you know that they're gonna sell. Yeah, right. here we are. We're at that point now, aren't we? How much more do we got? Looks like about two or three more. So I haven't seen the hundred. Maybe I just saved for last. Give me, damn it. This is gonna be the, the half hour of uh, half hours half an hour of repeats until one new one comes along. Hopefully not this extreme, maybe like five or ten minutes. Five or ten minutes, sure, why not? literally like two or three left so totally understandable <laughs>
do some research later for another uh, one-off case I do. Because this was actually my go-to for my one-off if ever I came to it. And you know, we did today, so I gotta find another one now. This. There are a few in my collection that I can think of, but I gotta double check. Hey, what a British person, how are you? You missed the Undertale finale. Now we're playing a random game, number 17. <laughs> I guess it's just a good morning where you are, huh? Good morning. Technically, it's, again, it's midnight, so it's technically morning here, too. So I can get away with saying good morning after all. So yeah, I did give a good listen to all the music I've been putting in the Discord. So again, thank you for all those. All pretty solid bangers, I would say. Fine, but my levels look like they're going off again, so I'm not too sure anymore. Please, I want out. Get me out of here. <laughs> Turning wheel now. Okay. Thank you for the feedback, Brad. Regardless, I'm going to play until I get these last few. But if we are actually here for another hour. Yeah, no worries, dude. If I don't see you later on, have a good night. And again, thank you for the raid. Really appreciated. And yeah, I'll hopefully hear from you next time. Either I visit you or you visit me. And also don't forget to vote if you are still looking, um, if you're not satisfied with what's coming up next in the games list here. But it sounds like you are looking forward to Mario Party, either, either way.
It's, like, it's hitting that. It's like turning into a real gacha game now. I mean, I think we're just not putting any real money into this, that's all. At the very least, imagine. Oh my god. Like, window for like the uh, Nintendo eShop pops up. Buy 30 credits. $25 or something. And even if that were the case, I'm pretty sure Nintendo would let that fly. I would hope. a little bit of manipulation by removing the news. Maybe that will help somehow. Probably won't, but this is my suspicion talking to me. Or my superstition talking to me. I guess you can use either word, right? shouldn't be. It's only been five minutes since I last did the time check. really do be taking longer than the uh, main game. I'm actually surprised. I hope that 100%ing this doesn't unlock up some other crazy, even harder, even more elaborate version of this. Already, please, I beg you. Is there a trick to it? I 
mean, I mean, there isn't a trait, but I feel like there could be one. Considering how trolly this game was the entire time. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. I'm not missing anything. Huh? Maybe I should look it up just to double check to make sure that uh, there's another trick to it. Real quick. This is a thing on PS. Really? Oh, actually. This is a game on PS. on the PlayStation Network. I don't know if it's PS4 or not. But there is trophies. Okay, it is PS4. There's trophies. Yeah, trophy for getting all the, uh. getting all the poses. Okay, so I mean, from what I could tell, it's just straight up just random until you get it. Jesus. Okay, well, keep going. Very, very interesting. Check this on PS4 too, just to get all the get, get some of the trophies. <laughs> Just so I can add another one to the collection or to my list of completes. What's the shortest game I completed on stream so far? Looks like I did Starship Damry for like three hours. Okay. Dude, if I take more than three hours on this game, holy. I mean, we're actually pretty close to the three hour mark. I'm kind of scared now. When I started this, 
because um, yeah, real quick. Finish Undertale at roughly the hour and forty. Hour forty five, okay. Just put them to a better perspective. Okay. An hour fifty five. Two hours. Right, I was into some music that are requested. Two hours and eight minutes. Okay, it's been two hours. Is the game loud? Okay, hold on. Let me fix that. How's that? Am I louder now? I think I lowered my volume just a little too my audio volume just a little too much. Yeah, we're good. So yeah, how are you, dude? How was your day? I guess your day technically just started, huh? It's morning. <laughs> Well, good morning. Any plans for the day? Sorry that you missed out on Undertale. <laughs> I didn't do much though. I just pretty much I fought. I fought. What did I fight? I fought Mad Mew Mew because you know Switch exclusive. I fought So Sorry by changing my internal my system date to October 10. On the Switch version, you can fight. You can fight So Sorry any day, um, any time on the 10th of October. So I just switched my date, and then I did the Undyne and Alphys friendships. There we go. We got finally got a pose. Butter. <laughs> right. So either one or two more. Mario 64, nice. Um, yeah. Did, uh, Undyne Alpha States. We did, um... We did, uh, True Lab. Then... Asriel Fight. I did see, I saw both, ver bo both variations. So I know how, like, when you talk tutorial. And if you want to stay with her or move, move out or go into the world. I did see both of them. So I guess it turns out uh, that the first human, Chara, like possesses you or something, hey? And then she goes on to do like, uh, or they go on to do like some creepy ass shit. I guess it's just serve as a reminder, even like even though you did genocide, and even though you were set it after genocide, it just serves to remind you like, yeah. The game will never forget what you did to them, to these people. <laughs> it's kind of fucked up, but you know, it makes sense for a game like that too. Because they talk about like resetting the timeline, aka resetting your game and starting fresh. But once you do, once you do the deed, you know, they don't want you to forget. So yeah, uh, basically with that, I did collect... Oh, there we go. Alright, we got them all. Sick. Finally. Okay, we got them all. Cool. I mean, it's good storytelling, though. Alright, all the poses we got. Sick. Sick, sick, sick. Let's go over them again, just, just because I want to see them all in their glory. So that's 77 points, 80 points. 85 for the Avengers style landing. 60 and negative 30. 55, negative 20, 83, 87 for the nin Naruto ninja log thing. 45, 2.5, 90, 88, negative 80, 8, 0, 22. 
77, 75 points because the shirt's undone. So yeah, um, for Undertale, I mean, I would, would like to revisit it, see if I can find the other neutral variants, just because. And also, I'm assuming that special credits at the end, if you dodge them all, you can open up that blue door back in Snowden. Which I have not done yet because it looks like it's super hard. So I'm going to save that as like an extra post 100% goal kind of thing. It gives me an excuse to play Undertale in the future if I want to, right? So. Eight, 26 in the bathtub. 95. 98 years. 70, 50. Oh, because he's turned around. This one I don't understand. 9.58 seconds. Is that supposed to be some kind of reference to something? He is striking a pose in this. Hold on, wait. Hold on, I might have a suspicion. Hold on. Oh, okay, it's a reference to Usain Bold. Okay. What's the pose that he made though? Oh yeah, here it is. I typed in I typed in Google Usain Bold pose. And it's exactly this pose right here. That's kinda cool actually. Okay. And then developer plug. Goku slash Journey to the West kind of thing. <clears throat> I mean, obviously Goku because it's a Nimbus. I don't understand this one, negative 25. 96, 97, 98, negative 40. 10 points for butter. I don't know if that means anything or not. Not sure. 90, 99, negative 50, 30, 47, 777. 75 kilograms, because sumo, negative 50, 68, 71. And there we go. Yeah, okay, well. That's going to be it for this game. And I think that'll be it for this stream today as well. I spent like almost... I spent two hours on this game. I didn't think I would spend two hours on this. God damn. So, yeah, I think that'll be it for me today. Completed two games, actually, with a with a hundred percent, hundred mo for hundred percent. Oh, actually, you know what? That's okay for Undertale. We did, we did one, two, three, four, five streams of Undertale. So actually, I owe four hundred more to people. out um yeah two games off the backlog done pretty sick so yeah okay um if i do stream later today for saturday most likely it's gonna be tetris effect or if i want feel like trying to find another one off i might but otherwise tetris effect if i do stream tomorrow later later today saturday Sunday, if I do stream Sunday, I think I'll finally get around to playing Animal Crossing catch up. I'm still back in July, so that'll be fun to do. Um, what else? What else? Oh yeah. Um, if you want to vote to, if you want to vote for the next game, do so in the Discord. Don't forget to do that. Um, again, I will probably start the new the vote winner on Monday, so I'll keep the voting deadline open until. Or the voting deadline will be on um, Sunday, well, I guess Monday, 12 a.m., midnight, whatever you want to call it. Oh, what is it? September 28th, Pacific, midnight, 12 a.m., whatever. <laughs> yeah. So, right now, Super Mario Party is in the lead with 326 votes. Um. And then we got what else? Donkey Kong Country 101. And then Pokemon Ultra Sun. I don't know how I'm gonna do that though with a lack of a proper DS uh, capture. Maybe if I can find one, I'll be more than happy to 
play it if it does win, but you know, we'll see. We'll see. I was gonna increase the 100% counter yet again today. Didn't think I'd do this twice in one day. But yeah, 41 games so far. I agree too. I mean, I'm down to play literally anything as long as people vote for it. If that's what they want to see, then i will be more than happy to play. That's how, it, that's how I'm doing my streams, right? Try to 100% literally my entire backlog if possible. So again, to recap, if I stream later today, Saturday, Tetris Effect, I'll try and get some double loss scores, hopefully. Although, very unlikely. Um, I have to do it regardless. Sunday, if I do stream Sunday, Animal Crossing catch up. Otherwise, I will see you guys on Monday for the winning, when we play the winning game. Uh, thank you to Lestikoff for the 100 bits and for the follow. Big thank you to Grad again for the raid. Really appreciate it. And also thank you to you guys who are still here chilling. Um, at the end of the stream. As always, all support is appreciated, so again, thank you. <clears throat> and as always, uh, if you are going out tomorrow, stay safe out there. And y'all have a good night. I will see you next stream.